Hi friends, today I'm going to make chicken curry without coconut milk. This is the things we need. Okay, I need almond, milk, cinnamon, dough leaf, a uh, dough flour. Sorry, I check in Google. In English, they say dough flour. I'm not so sure. Curry leaf, potato, onions from India. This is pandan leaf, tomato, ginger, garlic, Holland onion, and what else? Chicken, water, oil, salt, fish, no sorry, chicken masala, this is turmeric, chili powder and all the uh, spices here okay let's start now we are starting with first one we will blend we will blend the onions onions we put the onions okay i am putting almonds also almonds Onions, ginger, garlic, then we have to blend it, put, add some water, okay, enough, okay, okay, I already blend it, okay, Let's start. Where are you going to cook? I'm going to add oil. Add some oil. First put this and this and a bit curry leaves. And then add pandan leaf. After that, we will add onions. Onion was one big onion, one big onion. Okay, mix it. The flame must be medium, not high. Medium flame. Mix till the smell comes out. Two minutes frying, it become like that. And the smell also is out. We can add the blend, blend things inside. Be careful. Mix it. Mm, nice man. Mix it everything properly and then let it boil for three to four minutes till the oil is up on the surface. I will cover it. Okay, see guys, see friends. Uh, after five to six minutes, it's already it's like that. Now we can add chicken Maggie cube one and. Maggi choco rasa, just half spoon, house half, half spoon of it, and then we can add turmeric powder, turmeric powder, half. 
chili powder if you like more chili you can add more if you like less chili you add more uh, if you add less chili you put less more chili you can put more so i'm gonna put like this much a bit more okay we're gonna put all the masala this is fish fish uh, masala one two three big big spoon three and a half okay and then all the spices coriander powder this amount this okay half spoon and then half spoon of garam masala this much this powder jintan manis half spoon also and turmeric powder this is also a half spoon half spoon okay then we mix okay i'm gonna mix i'm gonna add some water half half cup first mix properly be careful huh? sometimes the thing will flash out the curry powder will flash out okay we will add some salt salt just how much for the flavor if not enough you can add more later on okay okay mix it and now we're gonna uh, boil it again at least for five to ten minutes to see the oil already out on the surface in malay we call pacha minya so this we're going to wait for five to ten minutes to boil it and the flame should be low and i'm going to close it okay after 10 12 minutes you can see the masala the already changed into different color and then now we can add chicken it's depends on your quantity today i'm using half chicken kampung chicken village chicken and then potato i'm going to put in i'm going to put in mix it out and then i'm not going to add water i'm going to add milk low fat milk from good day it's 200 ml i will not use coconut milk because coconut milk is not so healthy so i make it healthy just using this milk it will taste good also and the curry will be thicker and we'll add the tomato one big tomato and mix it well later later we'll add more water now let it boil let the the flavor of the masala go into the chicken and half like half cooked chicken like that then later on you'll add more water to make some curry because my kids like to eat chicken curry with rice or maybe with chapati see it's like that now okay we'll leave it to boil i think at least five minutes then we'll add more water okay okay after five minutes let's see how the chicken already put taking out the water the flavor i think will be very nice 
and now we need to add more water i am putting one cup full if you like more curry you can put more water now i'm going to mix it well and i'm going to let it boil till the uh, potato potato and the chicken cook i think it will take by 15 to 20 minutes uh, low flame no high flame uh, low flame because when you cook low flame the flavor will uh, what taste good if high flame it's not so tasty in this is my recipe this is my way okay you see the curry is thick because i add some elements in the the blender i blend it you see, with the onion so i add some uh, element see the curry sticker so now i'm gonna cover it again uh, i will keep it 15 to 20 minutes to let the potato and chicken to cook i'll see you after 15 minutes see the curry after 20 minutes we'll mix. We'll mix the curry and now we are going to check the potato if you poke with the fork it's going in that means it's already cooked then the chicken uh, the chicken's already done okay curry also very nice thick I already taste the curry, enough salt, no, no need to add more salt and the water, the curry is enough. So this is my chicken curry for today with the coconut milk. This is the curry which I make today, already done. Easy way to make chicken curry without coconut milk. You all guys can try in house. If anything, can uh, comment below. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Okay, friends. See you again in the next video. Bye. I hope you will like the curry. Bye. Bye.